Now after World War II, there were thousands of surplus military vehicles. They weren't offered to the general public. What happened was they were offered to market traders, people in businesses and car dealers and they bought them by the hundreds and hundreds for next to nothing and in the case of British Army trucks they either kept the original bodies on them or they rebodied them to customer requirements. Now this is a little brochure, Bedford Ford Morris Commercial Austin Comma. This was a, a booklet issued by the SMT which is the Scottish Motor Traders and this particular branch was in Carlisle and this is what they used to do to X surplus Bedford MW 1500 weight trucks with the canvas backs so we have one there Bedford MW type chassis completely reconditioned mechanically and fitted with a brand new coach built cab and flat platform lorry so originally that may have been an open vehicle if, if you know the Bedford MW it could have been an open vehicle with a canvas back on it and that was from 500 pound then over here we have a Bedford Scammell tractor unit completely reconditioned to take a six to eight ton load 550 pound the separate Scammell platform trailer 75 pound and another one 18 foot for 100 pound down here again it's been a Bedford open uh, canvas back truck 1500 weight completely reconditioned special aluminium paneled, paneled Luton type van body 550 pound up here a Bedford 4 5 ton tipper short wheelbase chassis and cab fitted with a brand new hydraulic end tipping gears and with steel and coach built bodies 600 pound and this is quite nice Bedford MW canvas back truck converted with this quite nice brand new special coach built van painted the customers requirements 575 pound then here we have the famous bedford three ton oy refitted with a brand new 14 foot coach built flat platform body 500 pound or you can have the same truck with a luton van body from 800 pound Austin Morris Bedford and Comma Vans from 420 quid. Buses, a little description, radios. So this was the SMT branch in Carlisle. Just a neat little booklet of how they refitted Bedford trucks for for customer requirements. They could probably buy them for about £50 a time. And interestingly. There's probably none surviving with these van bodies on them anymore. They were probably used to destruction and then scrapped. As newer vehicles became available, nobody wanted them anymore. So that's quite an interesting thing of what they used to do in England with post-war British military vehicles.